Hey guys, it's Patrick Star. Welcome back to my channel. So today I am giving you my November favorites. I'm so excited. I can't believe that this year has gone by so, so fast. And November was my birthday. November was the launch of my certification set for makeup artists. It's just been crazy. I went to Turks. I went back to LA. I settled into LA. I've been shooting a bunch of things that I cannot talk about for next year. Um, actually, January and February. It's coming up pretty soon and I am super stoked and super blessed and super happy. Super is the word of November. Super, super, just awesome. All right, so I just want to say thank you guys so much for 500,000 subscribers here on YouTube. I had my meetup by myself. It was my first one, number one, in Orlando, by myself, in my home city. I'm from New York, but I moved to Orlando. I claim myself as Floridian. And my family was there and it was so much fun. Thank you guys so much for coming. My brother did vlog it a little bit on his channel, so check out that video. And yeah, also on top of that, the students for my live certification courses, if you guys didn't know, I have a makeup certification course where I teach you everything. I send you a makeup box included. You guys get discounts and all the tools that you need to jumpstart your career. Thank you guys so much. If you guys are interested, check the link down below. What else? Like, November is so fast. I can't believe it's December. It was my brother's birthday. Santa's coming. Do you like my new little setup? This is like my little apartment living room. I've been dreaming of doing like a little setup like this since for so long because I've had like studio, um, just a plain white backdrop, but I will be doing a behind the scenes tour maybe on my filming setup. I don't have everything quite yet. I have my monitor, my two soft boxes, my tripod, and my camera, and today I am filming on my Sony A6000 camera. I'm not filming on my Canon, which I usually film on. Um, you guys have been asking a lot of those questions, but to get right into the video, I wanna start off with my favorites. Okay, so the first thing I'm gonna talk about is the Total Moisture Facial Cream by Benefit. This is super delicious. I don't know, it's like whipped cream for the face. Like, you know we all love dabbling in whipped cream. I love this for my hands, for my face, but more so especially for when I shave, like right here. You guys know I am a boy. If you guys are asking if you're a boy or a girl, I am a boy, my name is Patrick. I love this because as soon as I step out of the shower, before when I didn't moisturize right away, my makeup would be patchy, especially I think being in LA, it's a lot more dry than Florida. Florida is super humid. So I started to moisturize heavily right around here. So my powders, I love using powders, so my powders would lay on smoothly and more más suave. I don't know what to say. <laughs> what else to say? Because um, you get a más suave, se puede aplicar el hidratante de marque de benefit. Sí. Um, yes. So, what else? Y'all like, damn! Y'all like, you guys speak Spanish? Yes, I can. Okay, next I want to talk about um, this um, nail polish remover. I have been obsessed with polish and nails lately. Um, I'm, 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 I am wearing black nail polish, just standard black, and they have been shiny forever because like Formula X, I, I have never been into nails. Like I feel like I've been in Sephora so many times, I like memorize it, but I have never dabbled with hair obviously because I just wear scarves, and also nails and um, skincare, so I'm trying to conquer that section of Sephora, like I'm trying to study it more, but when I walk into Sephora, I'm always looking at the nails because it's like the next like cosmetic not cosmetic, like fun thing to look at apart from like hair and skin. So Formula X has been a fun place to look and I have been obsessed with their nail care, hands down. Their cuticle oil, I'm obsessed with their cuticle remover. Whenever I'm editing at night, I'll just like edit and like when I'm watching back my videos, I'll just like, if you look at my beauty room tour, check it out. You'll see my um, cuticle oil there when I'm editing. I'm just like rubbing in cuticle oil and my cuticles have been good so far. But um, this delete all is amazing. All you do is just dip your fingers in and the most stubborn, glittery, um, thick, opaque set polish, not gel, but regular polish, it will delete all. And this is so cool. It is the delete all nail polish remover. So there's like little holes on the top and you just stick your fingers right here, soak it, take it out, and it is the strongest nail polish remover 
ever. I'm planning on doing more so holiday festive nails. And I love this system because like, I know, when I say I know nothing about nails, like when I would look, there's like a system. So it's very informative for you. There, like with Formula X, it's amazing. There is the cleanse. It shows you, there's like, there's like sets of them. There's the cleanse, then you prime, then you can choose any polish, and then there's the shine. Like there are sets that are set out like that. Amazing, I love Formula X, and I love black. I have the black by them, it's amazing. And then their top coat is to die. And if you wanna change it up, just use their delete all. Hey, yes! I have been obsessed with my foundation lately. I have been very particular as far as what makes my skin look the most smooth because I do film in HD, like I can see my pores on my desktop and it's not cute. But um, I will have a skincare routine video up soon, but not quite yet. But in regards to makeup, let's just talk about the makeup. So the Porefessional has been a savior. Number one, because it's like a silicone based um, pore filler and I have really large pores right here on my cheeks and you can wear this on a day out Especially if you're of a darker tone a neutral tone any skin tone can wear it Just put on some powder and you're good to go. This really smooths out your pores. It's oil free as well um, I don't know why I have a sticker on this NARS. I was filming at a shoot. So this is the NARS all day luminous weightless foundation this foundation is amazing the reason why i love this is because it is so thin it is so micronized it also fills my pores i noticed like mac foundations are super thick and super heavy and i think the particles of the foundation are a lot larger so they sit more so on the skin that's why before i used to um no i still do i still press in my air spun because it really smooths out but i noticed in using products like the professional and a thin foundation like either this one or the dior it really makes my skin flawless so when you're trying out found trying foundations like in the store make sure to see if they're like thinner and if you like them because if they're thinner and you have large pores try it out and then um pack on some powder if you are oilier or if you want to get that smooth complexion finish because i love a b face as you can tell oh my god so i was at sephora in san francisco um, at the new sephora i believe downtown and they had this like machine and it's so cool because you can get your um perfumes like engraved and um i didn't get this one engraved because it's not in the system as to where i can get mine personalized and i believe it's free but this perfume is the gucci bamboo I'm saying that engraving part because I saw this perfume on that table by the engraving machine. So, this smells so good. To be honest, it smells like my mom. Me and my mom, we like have similar tastes. I, it's, it's crazy because I was always like, yeah, you smell too much when I was younger. But now, like, I have some of my similar styles to her. It's very floral. It's very clean. It's very like fresh. There's like a little hint of like freshness, but it's very floral. I love sweet and floral scents, but this one is Gucci Bamboo. It is amazing. Do you like my little setup here? I got this um, from the Tarte trip um, to Turks and Caicos. They gave this like this little memory book. I have yet to fill it up with photos, so friends send me pictures. Everything I never want to forget, and some things I do. And then my skull is from Marshalls. Um, Brenda decorated my room. Hey, Brenda. Really quick, okay, also for powder, when I want more coverage, I love the Makeup Forever Pro Finish Powder. I bought this one and then the darkest shade for contouring. This is similar to the MAC Studio Fix Powders. I love these so much. The MAC ones, oxidize. Hate them, do not like them, do not like them. The Makeup Forever ones, Pro Finish, they do not oxidize. They have an array of colors, and you should try them out. If you are an oily girl that doesn't like a lot of makeup, try this. If you are someone that's dry, try this, but use a dewy setting spray, like the Tasha spray, or Fix Plus, something that will make you more dewy. If you want something like concealer and powder, it's great for on the go. That's an awesome tip and trick for if you're on the go, because powder foundations have so much pigment and so much coverage. That's what I love about this one. Um, also, what am I obsessed with? Oh, let's talk about brushes. I am obsessed with these three brushes. I cannot live without these three brushes for my face. I don't know if you guys have seen a pattern in my favorites videos. I have an obsession for face and full coverage and for beating the face to the damn ground. 
but these brushes help me do it. The first one that I love for stamping in with my Pro Finish powder is the G0. Like when I'm baking with my airspun, I'll knock this off with the G0 brush using the Pro Finish or a mineralized skin finish from MAC because that powder is very micronized, though a mineralized skin finish. But this Morphe G0 brush is amazing. You have to have it if you're a makeup artist, if you are a makeup lover, anything. This is great for the body. This is great for bronzing down the neck, on the chest, on your breast. To like this brush is amazing. G0. It's the Gunmetal Collection, and you can use the code PET. It was, I, I forgot my code. P Star in store and also online on anything Morphe. Um, also, this is the Morphe M527, the brush that everyone has been talking about. This is a beautiful contour brush. I apologize that my brushes are dirty, but this is great because it's also pinched right here at the ferrule, and also it's very fluffy. I love this brush so much, the M527 contouring brush for your whole face for a weight loss look. Um, also, for a blush, this has been my brush for blush. This is the E3. It's tapered and it's great for contouring. This brush, like brushes like these are very versatile. So versatile, versatile, vers verse. These brushes are verse. And I love them. In contour, you can highlight because there's that tapered edge. And But for me, I use this for my blush right here. And I'm wearing Captivating Blush by Tarte Cosmetics. Are you captivated or not? Um, sorry I'm so hyper, like, I don't want to miss my plane, but I'm just, like, you know, just going with it. Lashes that I have been loving are New Bounce Them. I'm wearing those right now, the Bellas. And also, Lily Lashes Kuwait. Secret. I stacked the both of these together, and I'm obsessed with this lash combo. Let me get up close. Do you guys like it? Do you guys like it? So, New Balance is great. They offer a great discount code as well. And they're so, so beautiful. Lily has more custom, like, looks. I have never seen these kinds of lashes on the market. Um, they're just long, they're wispy, they're unique. And they, on, her, on Lily Lashes, there's a lash for everyone. On New Balance, there's a lash for everyone as well. But for my drama queens, if you are a Patrick Galici type of person, Definitely check out the Lily Lashes. They're amazing. The New Bounce, if you want something more for like bridal every day, but a statement, especially for New Year's, check them out. Like Lily Lashes for New Year's, amazing. New Bounce and Bellas or what's the other ones? Dragon Leaves, they're a little bit more wispy on the outside for that cat eye look. Amazing, um, and both you guys can use the code P Star for. Like I cannot live without these lashes. These are the only lashes that I've worn. I will stack some Ardell individuals, maybe every now and then for like an extra look. But right now it's New Bouncing and Lily all the way. Last but not freaking least, this palette is life. Oh my gosh, this is the Shimmering Skin Perfector Pressed and Champagne Glow. Um, this is by Jaclyn Hill, amazing, with Becca. There is Pearl, there is Champagne Pop, and Blush Copper. I believe this Blush Copper is limited edition. If you guys can see, this is amazing. It is beautiful. I'm gonna take my Morphe E3 and put it on right now. Um, the reason why I love these, because these are great for makeup artists, too. Um, when I was um, first in the, you know, shopping, in my beginning years, not too long ago. I was always looking forward to holiday because of sets like these, whether it be blush sets, obsessed with blush, or lipstick sets or lip gloss sets so I could build my kit. The holiday is a great time to like really build your kit and get nice brands into your um, budding or new makeup kit, especially if you guys are starting out, like check um, stuff like these out. These are investments and think about it like a little pro business tip. If you guys are scared to spend on something new, just make sure like in the future it's gonna pay itself off. I'm not saying to just buy the whole store and say that you're gonna get it paid off with your client's money, but this is just like a little makeup artist tip. Like you will gain that money back and it's about investing in great products so you guys can make more money, charge more, and really put great work out there um, one face at a time. This concludes my favorites video for the month of November. Thank you guys so much. I can't believe I hit 500,000. It's insane. 
Oh, and thank you for 700,000 on Instagram. It's insane. I just want to say I love you. I wish I could invite you all to my apartment here in LA. I have yet to have an LA meetup, but um, I probably will have one soon. Maybe when I hit a million. I don't know. Maybe, maybe, God willing. Maybe, maybe, maybe. But thank you guys so much. Happy holidays. I love you guys so much. Um, don't forget to subscribe. Give this video a thumbs up. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye. Thank you.